Something like that. Nobody I've been looking for you. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Dragon. Your hands only. Let's see here. Ah, a letter from the Jarl. Moving up in the world, eh? Looks like that's it. <laughs> Got to go. We got rooms and food. Drink, too. I cook. Ain't much else to tell. Let's sate that appetite, hmm? But then he went quiet, did Ragnar the Red, when he met the shield maiden Matilda, who said... Oh, you talk and you lie and you drink all our mead. Now I think it's high time that you lie down and bleed. So then came clashing and slashing of steel as the great black Matilda charged in full of seed. And the braggart named Ragnar was boastful no more when his ugly red head rolled around on the floor. Mm hmm. The ale is going bad. We need to get a new batch. You're that visitor been poking around. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. Ain't nothing aboard here. I can't do better. Did you hear me? Yep. Ale's going bad. I guess you don't have potatoes in your ears after all. Just make sure we get a fresh batch in soon. So, is it true?
right, then. Hi there. Of course. All right, then. Yes, sir. All right, then. It's the least I can do. This is a local favorite and one of the first songs I ever learned. Ragnar the Red. Oh, there was... Hey. Are you saying you believe in God, but not evil spirits? Yeah! <laughs> 
by Izmir, it's true. A jester, funny suit and all. Just north by the Loria's farm. Fool had a coffin and a cart with a broken wheel. I'd like to see him laugh his way out of that. <laughs> <laughs> It is closed with the dragons about. Official business only. You looking for a beating? Riverwood's in danger too? You better go on in. You'll find the Jarl in Dragon's Reach at the top of the hill. Whatever it takes, but we must have more swords for the Imperial soldiers. I just can't fill an order that size on my own. Why don't you swallow that stubborn pride of yours and ask Jorland Greymane for help? <laughs> I'd sooner bend my knee to Ulfric's Stormcloak. Besides, Greymane would never make steel for the Legion. Have it your way. I'll take the job, but don't expect a miracle. to do something about these vampire attacks. They say Helgen got hit by a dragon. One of those horrors comes here. They'll be ready. My lord, please. This What's is no the time meaning of this interruption? Jarl Balgruff is not receiving me. visitors. I just... Well, that explains why the guards let you in. Come on then, the Jarl will want to speak to you personally. Brigands I can handle, but this talk of dragons? Words so, gone you were at Helgen. You saw this dragon with your own eyes? By Ismir, Irileth was right! What do you say now, Proventus? Shall we continue to trust in the strength of our walls? Against the dragon? My lord, we should send troops to Riverwood at once. It's in the most immediate danger. If that dragon is lurking in the mountains... The Jarl of Falkreath will view that as a provocation. He'll assume we're preparing to join Ulfric's side and attack him. We should Enough. not... I'll not stand idly by while the dragon burns my hold and slaughters my people. Irileth, send a detachment to Riverwood at once. Yes, my Jarl. If you'll excuse me, I'll return to my duties. That would be best. Well done. You sought me out on your own initiative. You've done Whiterun a service, and I won't forget it. Here, take this as a small token of my esteem. There is another thing you could do for me. Suitable for someone of your particular talents, perhaps. Come, let's go find Faringar, my court wizard. 
He's been looking into a matter related to these dragons and rumors of dragons. Varengar, I think I've found someone who can help you with your dragon project. Go ahead and fill him in with all the details. So the Earl thinks you can be of use to me. Oh yes, he must be referring to my research into the dragons. Yes, I could use someone to fetch something for me. Well, when I say fetch, I really mean delve into a dangerous ruin in search of an ancient stone tablet that may or may not actually be there. Straight to the point, eh? No need for tedious hows and whys. I like that. Leave those details to your betters, am I right? I, uh, learned of a certain stone tablet said to be housed in Bleak Falls Barrow. A dragon stone, said to contain a map of dragon burial sites. Go to Bleak Falls Barrow, find this tablet, no doubt interred in the main chamber, and bring it to me. Simplicity itself. Ah! The dragon stone of Bleak Falls Barrow! You already found it. You are cut from a different cloth than the usual brutes the Jarl foists on me. You'll have to see the Jarl about that. Maybe his steward, Avenici. I'm sure one of them will pay you appropriately. Wait for me. Varengar! Varengar, you need to come at once. A dragon has been sighted nearby. You should come too. A dragon? How exciting. Where was it seen? W what was it doing? I'd take this a bit more seriously if I were you. If a dragon decide... But Whiterun, I don't know if we can stop it. Let's go. Do some hunting, eh? Avoid British in Faster than anything I've ever seen. What did it do? Is it attacking the watchtower? No, my lord. It was just circling overhead when I left. I never ran so fast in my life. I thought it would have come off to me. Good work, son. We'll take it from here. Head down to the barracks for some food and rest. You've earned it. Irleth, you'd better gather some guardsmen and get down there. I've already ordered my men to muster near the main gate. Good. Don't fail me. There's no time to stand on ceremony, my friend. I need your help again. I want you to go with Irileth and help her fight this dragon. You survived Helgen, so you have more experience with dragons than anyone else here. But I haven't forgotten the service you did for me in retrieving the dragon stone for Faringar. As a token of my esteem, I have instructed Avenici that you are now permitted to purchase property in the city. And please, accept this gift from my personal armory. I should come along. I would very much like to see this dragon. No, I can't afford to risk both of you. I need you here working on ways to defend the city against these dragons. As you command. One last thing, Irileth. This isn't a death or glory mission. I need to know what we're dealing with. I've seen with. you helping the Yarl. Don't if only worry, all visitors to I'm the very soul of court.
For we are one! Ere you ascended, and the eight became nine, you walked on the spring towers, walked as God. You tried mercenary work? It might suit you. Sometimes I miss the soldier's life, but when I hold my daughter in my arms, I know I'm. Here's the situation A dragon is attacking the Western Watchtower. A what? Dragon? Now we're in for it. You heard right. I said a dragon. I don't much care Can where it you? came from or who sent it. My wife's a good woman. What I do know is that it's made be a the little mistake of attacking White Run. I love her just the same. But house guard, how can we fight a dragon? That's a fair question. None of us have ever seen a dragon before or expected to face one in battle. But we are honor bound to fight it, even if we fail. This dragon is threatening our homes, our families. Could you call yourselves Nords if you ran from this monster? Are you going to let me face this thing alone? No, They're no, so dead. But it's more than our honor at stake here. Think of it. The first dragon seen in Skyrim since the last age. The glory of killing it is ours. If you're with me. Now what do you say? Shall we go kill us a dragon? Yeah. Damn yeah. right. Let's move out. Arts and Dragon Reach say you've aided the Yard on behalf of White Run, I think. Let's go. We need to get to the Western Watchtower before it's too late. What's the... Something like that. Yeah. Yeah. 
No, get back. It's still here somewhere. Porky and Tor just got grabbed when they tried to make a run for it. Okay, let's save us. Here he comes again. Believe it. You're Dragonborn. In the very oldest tales, back from when there were still dragons in Skyrim, the Dragonborn would slay dragons and steal their power. That's what you did, isn't it? Absorb the dragon's power. There's only one way to find out. Try to shout. That would prove it. According to the old legends, only the Dragonborn can shout without training, the way the dragons do. Dragonborn? What are you talking about? My, my grandfather used to tell stories about the Dragonborn. I'm glad you're on our Those side. born with the dragon blood in them. Like old Tiber Septim himself. I've never heard of Tiber Septim killing any dragons. There weren't any dragons How then, idiot. They're Dragon just Born. coming back now for the White first time need to fear forever. You on our side. But the old tales tell of the dragonborn who could kill dragons and steal their power. You must be one. What do you say, Yerle? You're being awfully quiet. Come on, Yerle. Tell us. Do you believe in this dragonborn business? <laughs> Some of you would be better off keeping quiet than flapping your gums on matters you don't know anything about. Here's a dead dragon, and that's something I definitely understand. Now we know we can kill them. But I don't need some mythical dragonborn. Someone who can put down a dragon is more than enough for me. You wouldn't understand, Housecar. You ain't a norm. I've been all across Tamriel. I've seen plenty of things just as outlandish as this. I'd advise you all to trust in the strength of your sword arm over the tales of legend. Something like that.
Already been told to not allow here. Turn around and go back the way you came. We're causing no trouble. All we ask is to look for her. I don't care what you're doing. After what happened, you're lucky I don't toss you in jail. Now get lost. We will be back. This is not over. You there. We're looking for someone in White Run. We will pay good money for information. A woman, a foreigner in these lands. Redguard, like us. She is likely not using her true name. We will pay for any information regarding her location. We are not welcome here in Whiterun, so we will be in Rorikstead if you learn anything. It's none of your concern. All you need to know is that we're paying for information. If that doesn't interest you, feel free to walk away. We're looking for a fugitive who comes from Hammerfell, a Red Guard woman. She may be somewhere in this city. She cannot hide from us forever. See you. You tried mercenary work? It might suit you. What then? Who the elves take your boats? Your businesses? Your children? Why, easily you did it. Who killed the dragon? There has been talk amongst the gods. Cloaks, Imperials, Dragons. Ain't no matter to me what I kill. Let them come. Good. You're finally here. The Jarl's been waiting for you. You heard the summons. What else could it mean? The Greybeards. We were just talking about you. My brother needs a word with you. So what happened at the Watchtower? Was the dragon there? I knew I could count on Irileth, but there must be more to it than that. Dragonborn? What do you know about the Dragonborn? So it's true. The Greybeards really were summoning you. Masters of the Way of the Voice. They live in seclusion high on the slopes of the throat of the world. The Dragonborn is said to be uniquely gifted in the voice. The ability to focus your vital essence into a thum or shout. If you really are Dragonborn, they can teach you how to use your gift. Didn't you hear the thundering sound as you returned to Whiterun? That was the voice of the Greybeards, summoning you to High Rothgar. This hasn't happened in centuries, at least. Not since Tybiseptim himself was summoned when he was still Talos of Atmora. Rangar, calm yourself. What does any of this Nord nonsense have to do with our friend here? Capable as he may be, 
I don't see any signs of him being this, what, dragonborn. No nonsense. Why, you <laughs> puffed up ignorant. These are our sacred traditions that go back to the founding of the First Empire. Prongar, don't be so hard on Avenici. I meant no disrespect, of course. It's just that, what do these Greybeards want with him? That's the Greybeards' business, not ours. Whatever happened when you killed that dragon, it revealed something in you, and the Greybeards heard it. If they think you're dragonborn, who are we to argue? You'd better get up to High Hrothgar immediately. There is no refusing the summons of the Greybeards. It's a tremendous honor. I envy you, you know, to climb the 7,000 steps again. I made the pilgrimage once. Did you know that? High Hrothgar is a very peaceful place. Very disconnected from the troubles of this world. I wonder that the Greybeards even notice what's going on down here. They haven't seemed to care before. No matter. Go to High Hrothgar. Learn what the Greybeards can teach you. You've done a great service for me and my city, Dragonborn. By my right as Jarl, I name you Thane of Whiterun. It's the greatest honor that's within my power to grant. I assign you Lydia as a personal housecarl, and this weapon from my armory to serve as your badge of office. I'll also notify my guards of your new title. Wouldn't want them to think you're part of the common rabble, now would we? We are honored to have you as Thane of our city, Dragonborn. Back to business, Proventus. We still have a city to defend. I serve Jarl Balgruff as steward. Splendid. There's a house available right now. Very well. Just let me know when you have the necessary funds. Yes, my lord. <laughs> Well, well, look who it is. How have you been? Can I help you? Of course. Traveler. What do you need? If we kill the dragon once, we can do it again. With your help, of course. The Jarl is, as you can imagine, very busy. The house I mentioned earlier is still available if you <laughs> want to buy it. Wonderful. Here's the key to your new home. If there's anything I can help you with, just let me know. Trust me. Need something? Hello, friend. I'll take my leave then.
The Jarl has appointed me to be your house, Carl. It's an honor to serve you. Pleased to meet you. Yes, my Thane? Are you Dragonborn? Mm-hmm. You couldn't possibly be the Dragonborn of Legend, could you? Cousins out and fighting dragons, and what do I get? Go I know your family's honor is important to you, but we can't afford it. It took me weeks to find that thieves' den. I can't stop now, and I can't get the sword on my own. So you're willing to starve your wife and daughter to reclaim some rusty old sword? I just need to hire one, maybe two good men. You won't starve. I'll put it plainly. You can claim your sword, or you can keep your wife. If you set foot mm -hmm. outside that gate, I won't be here when you return. Saphir! Wait, I... How can I argue with that? Trust me. Up for a little hey. hunting? What can I do for you, friend? Honored to see you again, my Thane. Until next time. Oh, what do you want, hmm? Don't let the door slam into your backside on the way out. Did that really just happen? You're standing in my way. What was that? Still here. Then how's that? I am your sword and your shield. And your shield. Yeah. Hmm? Worse things may be coming.